So your return on investment on your marching dollar is going to be less, but what else are you supposed to do? You can't do anything else. I've done this a long time and unfortunately you weren't born into it or you didn't have your uh, business started when the internet began to kick off, let's say somewhere in 2005, 2010, and really all the way from my experience of doing this for almost a decade now with a digital marketing agency up until five years ago, four years ago even. It wasn't that bad if you got online. Now it's still not horrible, but what it means is, is if it's a really large city, it might take you 10 or 12 months to get keywords up into the top organic rankings in your map placement. If the city's smaller and the website's brand new, you might do it in three or four months. It's possible in both these scenarios to still get some organic keyword clicks, but you're not gonna see your primary stuff go up. Hey there, it's Nolan Walker. You know, today I wanted to go over um, does domain age matter? Does, does domain age matter for SEO? And the answer really short is heck yes, it matters. Um, and, but let's discuss it. So let's discuss what's going to happen, how long it takes, what the hurdles are and what do you do? So I guess, so from a Google perspective, if they don't trust you, um, then it's rough because why would they show you? You could have the best website like we produce for you, which will be fantastic. And as I always like to say, the horse will run faster around the track. So it'll be gaining popularity and keyword ranking much faster. But when you start a hundred you know, or a thousand laps back, your horse can be running fast, but people are ahead of you. And you don't get any calls if your keywords are temporarily on page 10, right? But that is a reality depending on a lot of different factors. So let's go over if you have, you know, if the product in the city, if it's more obscure, it'll move up in rankings faster. If it's going to be something that, you know, in a, in a large city and you have a heavy competitive market, then that one will take longer. And so what do you do if you're in a large market that's competitive and there's a lot of competition? but you know you need a website and you want to get going organically. Here's the truth of the matter. You're going to need more diverse lead channels than someone who's already started. And it actually means you're going to make less ROI. So your return on investment on your marketing dollar is going to be less, but what else are you supposed to do? You can't do anything else. I've done this a long time and unfortunately you weren't born into it or you didn't have your uh, business started when the internet began to kick off, let's say somewhere in 2005, 2010, and really all the way from my experience of doing this for almost a decade now with a digital marketing agency up until five years ago, four years ago even. It wasn't that bad if you got online. Now, it's still not horrible, but what it means is, is if it's a really large city, it might take you 10 or 12 months to get keywords up into the top organic rankings in your map placement. If the city's smaller and the website's brand new, you might do it in three or four months. It's possible in both these scenarios to still get some organic keyword clicks, but you're not going to see your primary stuff go up. So you have a really well done website with diverse content and you'll see keywords that are less competitive go up because the quality of the site that they're on quality of the content and everything else around it that we do helps you get some in the meantime. Now, when I say this stuff, clients will inevitably take the very most negative things said and not listen to anything else like the thing I just said. You can get some clicks. You're just not going to get your primary keywords up immediately. In a small city, it could be as little as three or four or five months. If the product was really obscure, you might get it into a large city and be dominating within two or three months. But there's very few things like that that'll work now like that because there's typically competition levels. I had someone, you know, if, if it's something like mortgage loans, well, come on, you know, that's some of the most competitive stuff there is. And so, sorry about that. Um, so if you, have, um, if you have a large city, it's gonna take you longer. Here's the good news. Once you do get up in a large city, you're gonna get more clicks. You get a, you, as it gets up, you'll get, you'll get more. The small city, they'll come faster. And let's talk about the lead channels. 
So you do actually need a better website than competition with more pages and more stuff. But guys, you might also go buy some leads right now. Now, somebody that you want to be like that dominates organically, that's in all the mapping, if we're talking just an organic basis, some of those people may pay for, uh, pay for clicks and other things too. But those guys have that age domain. They've been running the track with the horse for a while and you're not. And so you may need to go buy some leads, but those leads cost you more than the organic would have, even with services. Services, to get it going, there's not a lot of great quality companies like ours to do it, but you get a good deal and then you get great results and your re return on investment is fantastic because you're getting organic placement on your keywords, you're getting map placement, you're getting reviews, and things are coming in from all over. But the person who has the organic already up there, well, he may not buy leads and he may not, or he or she may not even pay for clicks or do anything else because the organic is just that good. So organic makes their phone ring daily, they're happy, and they don't have to do the other stuff. But that's not you because you just started. So you're going to have to spend more of your gross revenue percentage-wise in order to get your business in the beginning before you get your organic going, repeat clientele, referrals, and things like that. And so if it's heavily competitive, it takes a little longer. But guys, you still have to do it. You can't just throw your hands up and say, oh, well, well, I'm launching a website, you know, in the, in the, in the, time that I'm doing it and everybody's already up there, so I just give up. No, you're a business person, you don't give up. You have to launch the website, you need to start your social media, blog needs to happen, changing content needs to happen, Google account and reviews need to happen, domain authority needs to happen, regular social activity needs to happen, videos maybe need to happen. All that stuff needs to happen. Don't, don't give up on it. You can get up and going. We've got tons of clients who got up and going and they dominate their market today. Took them a little bit longer, but they did it. Focus down on your marketing. Know that you can complete the task and you can do it. I've got plenty of clients that we can show you that started, in fact, I was just talking about one of them to a client that was only a couple of years old and um, now has uh, three trucks on the road and is busy all the time with multiple calls every day. So, and, and it didn't take two years to do it, by the way. The first six months were a little rougher and then as time went on, I think within a year, he got one extra guy and now he's busy all the time. So, hope you enjoyed that one. It's a question that so many people have. Um, you know what, actually, it's a question people have, but not enough. Um, they don't realize it, actually. So they're calling around, you're listening to web companies, they're lying to you just to get a sale, and they don't tell you this stuff. If somebody calls brand spanking you, we have this conversation with them. Because I don't want to put somebody online, spend a bunch of money, because we typically launch somebody with almost no money down or 99 bucks or something, and then we spend thousands. I don't want someone leaving in two months because they weren't instantly, you know, just banging on, online just perfectly. So you'll get stuff happening, and it will move up, and believe me, the more quality of the service you get, the better it happens. So hope you enjoyed it. We look forward to hearing from you. Call when you have questions. We'd love to be a service.